Hello, this is Miss Co here with this week's social emotional story. This week, you guys have been learning all about managing your anger. Everyone feels angry sometimes. It's natural to feel angry. You can tell by your body whether or not you feel angry. Your heart might race. You might feel warm. You might start to breathe really heavy. <sighs> it is not okay to be mean or to use hurtful behaviors when you're angry. Instead, we can learn to relax our body to help us feel better. Before we get started on today's story, let's repeat our listening rules. Eyes watching. Ears listening. Voice quiet body calm. This week's story is titled, Sometimes I'm a Bomb Baloo, and the author is Yumi Hio. My name is Katie Honors, and I'm a really good kid. I smile a lot because usually I'm happy, and I give excellent hugs. I brush my teeth without being reminded too much. I can Velcro my own shoes and put my toys where they belong, including the ones with 60, 40, eight small pieces. I remember about using my napkin and the magic word. I don't whine or stomp my feet or growl. Even if my brother knocks down my beautiful castle I just built and I told him not to touch it and I'll never be able to get it to look that good again. Sometimes I can hold in the tears and the pushes and just say, that's okay. But sometimes, I'm a bomb baloo. I show my teeth and make fierce noises. My face scrunches tight like a monster's. I use my feet and my fists instead of my words. My toys end up all over the floor, and so does my brother. There is a lot of yelling when I'm a bomb blue, and some pointing at my bed. I have to go take some time for myself and think about it. But when I'm a bombaloo, I don't want to think about it. I want to smash stuff. I can come out when I'm ready to control myself and say I'm sorry to my brother. But while I'm a bombaloo, I'm not sorry. I'm angry. I hate everybody and everything, even my dog Vanilla, and my penny collection, and my blankie, and my mother, and all of the clothes in my drawers. On their way out of the drawer, a pair of underpants lands on my head, like a hat. When I laugh, I'm Katie Honors again. And I'm sorry, and a little frightened. It's scary being a bombaloo. My mother knows that. She hugs me and helps me clean up the mess bombaloo made. And then, after some sorries and kisses from my brother, we build a new castle together. The end.
give me a thumbs up if you like today's story. Remember, boys and girls, it's natural to feel angry, but we have to use our words to tell other people how we're feeling. You can do things to help relax your body, like sitting in a comfy place or holding your favorite stuffed animal. This week, I want you to talk to the grown-ups in your home about what you can do when you feel angry. I want you to talk about what you cannot do. You cannot hit or push or yell. I want you to talk with your family about what you can do. You can find a quiet, lovely place to be in your home when you need to. You can ask for hugs. You can look at your favorite book or pet your pet or stuffed animal. There are lots of things you can do to help relax your body when you feel angry. See you next time.